Hi friends, welcome back to Abundant Gains. If you are new to my channel, my name is Laura and here on my channel I talk all things budgeting. So if you are into watching cash stuffing, sinking fund updates, and more, then please do consider subscribing and join my Abundant family. So today I will be doing a bill exchange also known as a bill condensing video and what that simply means is i am going to take the small bills out of my envelopes and convert them into big bills so downsizing my envelopes and giving them more room before i get started i just want to say thank you so much for all of the love that i received in my last video um, you guys have been leaving comments and just super super sweet comments and supportive comments and i'm definitely just over the moon that i came back to youtube with such a i don't know just such a supportive group of people that um are willing to still watch me grow and go through my journey the good and the bad so i'm just really really freaking thankful and the crystal for today's video, we have selenite, I have a heart selenite, and we have a hematite, hematite, hematite. <laughs> and I picked these two because since we are pretty much resetting my envelopes, I wanted to go for a renewing energy and a grounding energy, which is what these two are going to do for me. And... I also have a third little helper to get me through today's video and that is some Stella Rosa. This is peach Stella Rosa and it has Wicked Witch on it. I freaking love these wine glasses. Um, yeah, it's one of those days. It's one of those days and on top of that, it's a vibe. We're here to chill, relax, learn. So, you know, grab whatever it is that you want to grab. And let's go ahead and just get into this video. I have not done a bill condensing video in so, so long. So with that being said, I might be a little all over the place, okay? So I have a few 50s here that I withdrew from the bank. So $200, have 50s, and then I have a few placeholders that are from my shop. Um, of course, I created some for myself, and these 50s are, of course, to help with the ones that don't exactly make it to 100, but I still want to uh, minimize as much as I can. All right, so let's start with my sinking funds binder, and... You guys might notice that the ambiance in today's video is a little different. I usually film in natural lighting, typically around like golden, like sunset vibe, golden hour. But it's so cloudy today. It's a terrible little overcast that we have. So I had to bring out the lamp and I have it next to me. And so I do not have my little rotating colored lights going right now, which really sucks, but it's okay. This is what it would look like. It's just, it's just a little too dark. There's like absolutely no sun peeking through in front of me right now. It's just straight clouds and I have trees. So that also gets in the way and blocks the sunlight. I'm going to keep it at this little yellow light because it gives cozy vibes and I love it. So fur babe, it literally only has $10. So that is not going to have anything to exchange. I was going to do another cash stuffing today. I had just a little to go ahead and do so, but I really want to condense these envelopes because these, bi these binders are just getting so thick and um, counting them just takes forever. So we're, we're just gonna keep it pushing. So. For birthday, I have 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, $45. So emergency, we have 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. All right, here is a placeholder. 20, 40, 60, 80, and 200. So I have two different designs. I have the worded one, uh, and then you guys will notice that there's different backgrounds for the designs. And then I have the zodiac one, which is whatever your zodiac is. So this is big Capricorn energy. And 
I don't know which one I want to use. Um, doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. So we're just going to keep it with these two. So we've got $200 over here. 20, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, and 33. So we're going to keep it like this for now. And honestly, I have no idea what I'm doing, but just like cash stuffing goes, there is no right or wrong way to do this. <laughs> so we are just going to knock this out confidently and hopefully not get too doesn't and hopefully it doesn't get too crazy okay future home we have 20 40 60 80 100 10 20 30 35 36 37 and i do have this is where the fun part begins so i do have uh, this 10 here that i could exchange these two tens for 20 so 1 20 30 35 36 and 37 i'm curious to see what i'll take back to the bank oh goodness gracious some of these bills let me see if i have anything here actually that could be exchanged for those uh for 10 or 20 five six seven eight nine ten yeah so 10 here 20 30 31 32 33 there we go all right so i did go back really fast and at this point i'll put these back here put this here and here and put these fives and ones here if you have been watching me for a while you know that i do not wear short nails at all ever i i have nubs so i'm always very like embarrassed to to film or do anything with um what is it with with my without nails so i'm not gonna get my acrylics done until after the first weekend of november so i went and got these from target and they're really really cute and i'm honestly really surprised that i i actually like how they look i i don't hate it and it i don't know they're just really cute okay all right yeah I, I mean i'm keeping my cool right now but i really actually freaking love them Healthcare. let's see what we can condense in here we have 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 and 32 so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so twenty, thirty, thirty-one, and thirty-two dollars. Mystery. Let's see. So we have fifty. 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. Okay. So we have 1, 150, 51, 52, and 53. Okay, savings. So there's a 50, 20, 40, 60, 81. I literally only have one 100 left. <laughs> I did not make more, so I wasn't expecting this. I thought six was enough. Um, so that's 100, that's 150. 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. Doesn't hurt to double check. Finally putting these 50s to use. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna just keep it like this for now because I don't know if I'll need that. So we're gonna wait. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Now 
All right. So that has been condensed. Okay, y'all, the setup might look a teeny tiny bit different because I, I'm over here touching stuff and, um, <laughs> and I was not recording. So where I left off was, um, put everything back in, in tattoos and then taxes. I put in a 50 because I only had $50 in here. Ooh, I was like, I'm so happy. I caught that before I got further into this and realized way later. <laughs> you guys see all those ones I have so far. And then for my vacation binder, I'm going to condense my flights challenge. It's just a bunch of um, 10s and 15s and 1s. I mean, 10s, 5s, and 1s. <laughs> so let's see. We have 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50. 55, 60, 65. All right. So 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50 dollars. Okay. 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So this looks a lot better. So I have $75 for flights. And if any of these numbers are off for whatever reason, of course I have my YouTube videos I can just look back on because I didn't write them down. Um, I'm just lazy. So don't be like me. And since I have so many fives and ones, I'm going to separate them and just move this on up. Alright, six months ahead needs lots of condensing. Let's see. 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51. Well, one. Oh, I was like, wait a minute. This is all jumbled up. 20, 40, uh, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 100. So let's just take this 100 now. Okay. And then I know this here is $50, but I don't have any more 50s. So let me just recount 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. And I'll just do 20s, 20, 40, 50. Okay, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, and here is a 20. So 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. Hmm, what can I do? Well, we can take back these 10s, take out another 20. One, two, three, four. All right, so six months ahead is complete. And if you hear like a very staticky, windy kind of sound, that's Kristen's fan going because she's taking a nap. She works overnight. So this is usually the time she's still asleep. And so her fan, the fan in the room is going and the door is open. So um yeah you might it might sound a little windy sort of maybe not <laughs> so my sneakers challenge has lots and lots of tens so 10 20 30 40 50 60 65 70 so we already know we're gonna do these 20s all fives are gonna go 
so I have no more 50s and no more placeholders. And if you've made it this far into the video, go ahead and drop a bat in the comments. Since I do have these bats on here popping off, let's go ahead and do bats in the comments. <laughs> let's see what Feeling Thrifty has. It's, it's a lot. So 10, 20, 10, 15, 20, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. One, two, three, four, five. And let me know if you guys have any fun, exciting plans for Halloween um it's next week and I want to know if you guys have any spooky plans anything fun anything with your family or your kids or your significant other for me I'll be going to a Halloween party this weekend at one of my friends and they typically have one every year so every year I've been going and last year um they had a costume contest <laughs> and me and Kristen won and because obviously we were like we arrived there together we just kind of like split it or whatever I don't remember how much it was but it was fun and I was kind of like this like vampire yeah I was a vampire and she was I can't remember the name but yeah it was fun so it's coming back around already and whatever money I have in my Halloween right now is what I'm going to buy my my costume with. But I don't really think I'm going to dress up. I might do like my makeup or something. Something simple and cute. Uh, but I still want to do something. So I'm sure whatever I have in Halloween right now will um, help me when I buy something in a few days. So we have 10, 20. And these fives. and a 10. <laughs> I forgot a 10 so let's grab that and we are almost finished thank goodness so let's go on to Christmas 10 15 20 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, the ones are usually the, um, I don't even know what to call it. The ones are usually the ones that take up all of the envelopes space. And last one is Halloween. Let's see. 10, 15, 20. I might run out of all these 20s by the time I finish this. <laughs> 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. These ones are really rough. I really want to take these back to the bank. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. All right. So. Oh my goodness, everything has been condensed, you guys. All right, we're gonna have to split up these ones. It's too much. Everything has been condensed. That just pretty, pretty much doesn't even look like it has anything inside at all. And then this is still a little thick, but it looks a lot better. And it's not gonna be hard for me to close it. So before I go ahead and count all of this to see what I will be taking back to the bank, um, I want to show you guys a custom that I recently created. And this is for a customer who wanted a custom binder for her puppy that she is adopting soon. And she told me exactly what she wanted and I went ahead and 
worked with what I could. She gave me creative freedom to jazz it up however I wanted. So I've done other customs before. I've done custom savings challenges and custom envelopes, but this is my first custom binder with envelopes, challenges, a dashboard. So I'm just really excited and I'm just really proud of myself because this just turned out way nicer than I thought it was going to turn out. So the puppy's name is Orpheus. So here is the dashboard and Orpheus is a Greek god and he is the god of poetry, music, arts, all of that good stuff. So I kind of took that and try to implement it as best as I could while still um, keeping it within theme and not doing too much. I did not really think that I really liked this dashboard as much, but uh, the owner, she loved it and so I stuck with it. Then she requested a few savings challenges and I decided to do three savings challenges plus a fourth, which is one for my shop that's going to be included as a freebie. So here is the savings challenge. I have a $300 challenge, all 20s. As always, the challenge is an envelope. And then here is another challenge just with um, the dog's name on it, which is Orpheus, of course. And look at the details. Super cute. And then the last challenge of $775 savings. Because it is spooky season, I thought this would be so cute to add down here. And then let's look through the envelopes. Maybe this will give you guys some ideas if you have a pet and want to save for your pet. So we have adventures, collars and leads, emergency fund, enrichment, grooming, holistic health, nutrition, supplies, training, and toys. And then I added back here, Handmade with Love, with my little Cricut Joy Machine that I have a love-hate relationship with. So that is the binder bundle um, for her pet. Let me know if you guys like it. I freaking love it. And um, I just could not wait to film today to show you guys this because it was completed today. And so it's going out tomorrow. So yes, I of course do um welcome in customs and inquiries about customs whatever it is that you want to do if you want like a starter bundle for like your first set of envelopes like anything that you want i will be more than willing to work with you and create that for you and now let's go ahead and count up this cash All right, so right here we have 500. Oops. So we've got 500 in this stack here. I'm gonna put that right up at the top and let's go ahead and keep going. We have 10, oops, 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 200. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 
1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 80. 81, 82, 83, 84, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90. In total, I have $790 going back to the bank. This will be in my savings account. I am looking to open a high a high yield savings account with my bank and see what I have to do in order to open up my high yield savings because ultimately that is where I would want to put this money into so that it can continue to grow and um, earn more than just you know that interest and be a little extra safe. So $790 and this is on my low income. This is my very first bill condensing video that I have done all year long. So even with a smaller budget, you are still able to go ahead and save because at the end of the day, every dollar counts and it's better to be saving and doing something than nothing because as you can see here, um, even with a bunch of ones, <laughs> every dollar adds up and does add up pretty quickly. Go ahead and take a sip because we have to celebrate. We almost had $800 going back to the bank. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. I truly hope that you enjoyed watching this video and that you learned something. And don't forget to like, comment, and share. You don't have to subscribe. It's okay if this isn't your thing. You do not have to be here. But um, definitely share with someone that you know could, um, could learn a little something from the cash stuffing community and what a cash budget is. And every time that you guys like and comment, that helps put me in the algorithm and helps me go to the right screens for all of us out there that are trying to just figure out the best way to deal with our finances. And I can't wait to see you next time. Bye.